What has been your drive for Thinkation? Because I've seen the way you pushed it, pushed it, pushed it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, um, Thinkation is an event that started with my husband and it's something that was very dear to his heart and it's a vision that he outlined to me and I bought into it. It became our family vision and um, I'm really interested, you know, particular. I want to ensure that that legacy that was started, that was birthed in the mind of Ubon King doesn't die for any reason. Because um, the motivation behind Thinkation is not just about um, gathering people every January, it's about the impact. Ubon King and I, we're passionate about affecting the lives of young people. And that continues. So it's a motivating drive because for everybody that comes into this event and then goes back and implements one or two things in their business and it turns around, you know, that's the joy, that's the fulfillment. What would make you feel like this was a success? Okay, um, for me, is in the quality of um, the decisions that people decide to take after now. So um, when people listen to the speakers, that's not enough for me. When people show up, that's not enough for me. It's when people decide to act on the things that they have heard and then they can, this measurable impact in their lives. That's the fulfillment of the question. Even if it's one person, mm. even if it's one person, that's the fulfillment. When someone, someone is currently going through tough times, they think of giving up. So what can you say to them to encourage them to move on? Okay, I think um, what I want to say is that regardless of what life throws at you, regardless of what happens, life continues. Tough times are not enough for you to want to give up on life. No matter how tough it's been, there's something still on the inside that is yearning for you to give it expression. And if you give in to the despair, you might miss out. So life is in stages and in phases. Things come, troubles and challenges come, and they come to pass. They don't come to stay. So do not dwell on the negatives. Fix your mind on on the future. Fix your mind in, on what is coming ahead. And you definitely get past those challenges to what God has for you. So that's my encouragement. Trials and troubles do not come to destroy us. They come to help us build capacity and strength for the next level of life. So if you miss that, you miss out on what God has for you. So this is my message to everybody. Thank you very much, Ma. This is one person that inspires me because...